Good evening, everyone. This is Leonard Gutman, Assistant Cantor at Shire Aesthetic. What I'd like to talk about is finding meaning in traditions and rituals for the high holidays. This high holiday season is different than all those that came before. Confronted with the global pandemic, we cannot gather to worship and celebrate in person. While we are reimagining what our communal prayer will look like, we can also take advantage of the potential solitude that offers space for deep introspection as we spiritually prepare for the new year. We are all mourning losses. We are praying for health, happiness, and safety, while finding creative opportunities to think differently about the powerful rituals of this time of the year. So I encourage all of you to spend time during this month of Elul reviewing the prayers of Slichot, the prayers of Rosh Hashanah, Yom Kippur, and Sukkot. And by this I mean, like, for example, the, the Hallel, Psalm 27, the Hinani, Barosh Hashanah, Unatana Tokav, and many more. Read them first in English to understand their power, and then during the high holidays, you will have a greater experience when Chazan Prophus brings the true meaning of these prayers to life through his singing. The prayers will resonate more powerfully in your mind and in your neshama, your soul. In this time of preparation, understanding the magnitude of these traditional prayers will enhance and bring fuller meaning to your high holidays giving you the momentum to bring their substance into action in the coming year. Let us open our hearts to these most beautiful prayers to begin our year. May you all have a sweet new year filled with happiness and joy and have a Shabbat Shalom.